guys welcome back to my channel my name is Charlene and today I'm going to show you on how to plant your own sunflower now sunflower needs a lot of Sun and a lot of water so you need to take really good care of them and a tip that I have learned in this past few days that I got my sunflower is to when it is windy I remove it from outside normally my sunflower is over here but today it's a bit windy so it is moved to somewhere outside but more a more closed place where the wind doesn't get to it too much because when I had sunflowers before and I left it outside in the wind it died because it got dry and it's dried so it needs a lot of sun yes but it doesn't like the wind at least mine doesn't so when it's windy i put them inside or in a place especially at night i put my sunflowers inside and during the day if it's not windy they are outside here in the sun in the full sun but when it's windy they are still outside but in a more uh, closed place so let's get started and see how we are going to plant our seeds today. So we have our pots of soil and I watered the soil a bit before planting the seeds so the soil will sort of take its place in the pot. And we have the sunflower seeds. Now these seeds are seeds of the bigger flower. I have the small flower already planted and grown and I will going to show it to you very soon but these seeds are for a much bigger flower so here I have the sunflower seeds okay and all you need to do is Push with your finger just one centimeter and put, I put two seeds in, in the hole and the pointy part, this part, I put it facing up and cover again with the soil. And start doing the same in the other parts. And cover well. Now, when you're ready. I planted more seeds before so you have to plant a bit more than it's than I have shown you to make the plant more stronger so you need to plant more than I have shown you when you're ready by planting the seeds push the seed push the soil down to secure everything leave it in the Sun now if it's windy at this point if it's windy you can still leave it outside because obviously there is nothing growing but when it starts to grow as i t as i said before when it's windy put it inside or in a place that it is that the wind doesn't catch it now water it every day and give it at least eight hours of full sun sunflowers love the sun obviously they are named after the sun so they love the sun and water it every day because they love water as well so let me show you my small sunflower and these are my sunflowers now this is opening and this is already drying so it soon needs to be cut off now when you cut when it the sunflowers are drying you need to cut them off from here so the energy of the plant will go down to the plant again because if you leave the 
dying flower over here it will take a lot of energy from the plant so you need to cut them sorry my fingers are a mess with the soil so you need to cut them from here so the energy will go back down to the plant all right so look i have flowers coming out from here and from there and from here this is soon going to open and i have another one here and i have another one here and when you see these rotten petals, you need to cut them as well from here. Again, so it won't take energy from the plant that is not needed. So this is kept outside. It is outside but it's it's inside here at the moment just to show it to you guys but it is kept outside in a place where the wind doesn't get to it or else it will dry and this is how my sunflower grown after about three weeks Okay, so thank you all for watching. This is my daughter, Rochelle. Say bye. Bye. Thank you all for watching. Hit the like button if you liked the video and subscribe to the channel for more videos. Thank you so much for joining us and take care.